Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 26th of June 1963, American President John F. Kennedy declared US support for West Berlin with the phrase, Ich bin ein Berliner. I am a Berliner. 22 months after the Soviet supported DDR, most commonly known as East Germany, built the Berlin Wall. Berlin had been a focal point for Cold War tensions ever since the Yalta and Potsdam conferences in 1945 divided the city and the rest of Germany between the four victorious powers at the end of the Second World War. When the USSR imposed the Berlin blockade from 1948 to 49, the Western Allies made it clear that they were not willing to back down in their support for West Berlin, when they airlifted supplies into the city. Although the airlift secured West Berlin's survival, it further increased tensions between the USSR and its former allies, as East Germans crossed the border in order to defect to the non-communist West. This placed an enormous economic strain on the East, which began suffering labour shortages. In response, the government of East Germany erected a barbed wire fence around West Berlin that eventually developed into the imposing Berlin Wall, although the government claimed that it was to keep out spies and agitators rather than to stop people from leaving. It was against this background of heightened tension that Kennedy delivered his rousing speech on the steps of the Rathaus Schoenberg, the seat of the State Senate of West Berlin. While the speech effectively recognised East Berlin as part of the Soviet bloc, it also reaffirmed America's commitment to defend the West against communist expansion. (laughs) 